Speaking here with George Colony, the founder of Forrester. And uh, George, I just talked to an employee of Forrester who said, I'm stuck here with my BlackBerry and I cannot take a new mobile device to the company. How does that work? Well, uh, we, are, we are a company which uh, has, stand has standards. Yeah. However, we are now changing those. And so you'll, we actually are, you'll be able to bring any device you want to work and use any device you want at Forrester. Okay. When will that happen? Uh, I think it's happening in the next several months, actually. Okay. So you see also, I mean, you basically are a big prophecy of, of change and of mobile, of mobility as the number one thing, yep. which basically the CAOs needed to integrate. How hard is that to integrate it into existing systems? Well, remember, mobility means that you're going to have to have software, which is alluring for customers that they can, they can load on their phones. And most companies, I would say 85% of the companies, do not have the skills to build that software. That's going to be the big breakthrough. In the future, every company will be a software company. Every company will be the software. So that means if you do not know how to write software to deliver to your clients, you're going to be out of business. Software will be a, will be a more important asset than, than capital. It will be a more important asset than labor. It is going to be, it is, it'll be the articulation point where companies succeed or fail in the future. Software is going to be the center of how, are, how these companies will do business. Okay, but George, you're like a salesman who says, my product, you know, this new digital product is the most important. I just talked to somebody else, a CIO, I asked him, how many of your people uh, are doing IT? Two and a half percent. Well, what is the budget? About three percent. How can people become a software company with budgets and with uh, systems and, and, and people allocations like that? Yeah, so, so we strongly believe that technology management, the techies in a company, will have two agendas, an IT agenda to run the business internally, but they also have to take on a, what we call the BT agenda, which is the business technology, which is about, uh, business technology is very simply defined as systems, process, and technology to win, retain, and serve customers. So we, this well, we call that CRM, right? Before CRM, CRM, CRM would be one of the one of the one of the business technologies. Yeah. But the most important business technology yeah. will be that software that the customers actually use as they move through time and space. Yeah, and that is basically through mobile. Mobile will be a very interesting. What is a good example of a business which has changed through mobile? What is one of the early birds? Well, uh, we actually are tracking uh, Z, uh, Siemens is using mobile engagement yeah. uh, for the technicians who are serving. Their, uh, their wind turbines, very cool application actually. Uh, Deutsche Bank, as it turns out, is changing their experience within their banking, uh, within their bank branches, to be able to engage customers within the bank branch. They have the most horrible systems ever. I'm a Deutsche Bank uh, user, and their Java shit is so unbelievable far from user satisfaction. Is that an example of how the world is going to become? Well, they that, they have 250 bad applications today. Yeah. They're getting rid of all those applications and replacing them with these new systems. Okay. George, you started Forrester and you've been talking about lots of waves of digital change. Yeah. Uh, is this just one of the changes? What, what, what do you see as the big waves you've been talking about in the last 30 years? Well, this is, this is the big one okay. because this is what we call the age of the customer. The customer is now taking control. The customer is now taking power from institutions and from companies. And as they take that power, all companies will have to respond. And that's why they're going to have to be software companies. That's how they have to respond to that very, very powerful customer. So this is more important than the start of the internet or the start of the PC or the, the client server or everything? Or is this just the most important thing for now? This is, uh, there, uh, every way was important. Let's put it that way. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah. One question. What will Forrester be in uh, 10 years? I think we'll be a company primarily focused around uh, our data business. We, do, we, we gather data on 85% of the world's GDP, so we know exactly what every customer, every consumer, B2B and B2C, is doing in every large economy in the world. I think we'll be, much, we'll be a, a bigger data company in the yeah. future. Except the kids under 10 years old. Huh? That's not allowed. We can't survey people under 18 years old. <laughs> <laughs> and they will change the world. Uh, if you look at the Z generation, which yeah. is 18 and younger, yeah. they are massively different than the Y generation, which is 18 to 28. That's true. Thank you, George. Thank